It's time. It is Christmas morning. The day we've all been waiting for. Brilliant days are actually still sleeping. I just got done working. It's still dark outside, so I'm getting the living room set up downstairs with all the Christmassy stuff. With all the Christmas stuff, getting her room set up, the music room, getting it ready. Everything is about to be ready for Christmas morning. Merry Christmas, everybody. We got a lot of gifts this year for Braley, and you guys got gifts for Braley this year, and it's just been, it's awesome. Beyond gifts, the most important thing, the most important thing is family and friends. That's definitely the most important gift. Just the fact that we get to, we get to share Christmas together. I'm very thankful for that. All right, let's get started. Last year I thought about how things can come around just like that if everyone is here to celebrate one day. We have our ups and downs, but when there's love, there's always a way. And oh, this time of year, we come together to celebrate. The big one here, which I am actually I'm going to cover that up right now. There we go, nice and covered up. That's kind of creepy, actually. So my plan is, Bradley's gonna wake up, you know, get her breakfast and everything. Then we're gonna take her down the stairs for what we're first gonna show her. Music room. It's all ready for her, then we're gonna have her. Then we have the YouTube presents right here. And then after that, we are going to come out here, like this, and then at that point, we'll probably end up not vlogging too much after that, just because we want to do, you know, the family Christmas thing. We're gonna actually go pick up Braley's grandma. We're gonna have a good family time. I'm sure later on we'll show you guys what she got. Last year she actually had a really tough time with Christmas. Part of it, I think it was really overwhelming, like the, the amount of presents and stuff like that. So this year, we are just going to leave the presents right here in the middle of the living room. We're just gonna leave them out there and she, we're gonna let her open them at her own pace. It may take a few minutes, it could take a couple hours, it could take a couple days. Either way, we're just gonna leave them out there for her just because that we think will be the best way to keep her from getting too overwhelmed with all this new stuff that's happening. Even though the music room is gonna be so epic, I'm a, I am a little worried that it could be overwhelming for her. We're just gonna take it one step at a time today. The most important thing is not these things, it is her happiness. And we just wanna make sure she has a great Christmas. If anything at any point becomes overwhelming for her, we're gonna take a break. We'll just relax, do some sensory stuff, you know. So really, we're just gonna go at Braley's pace today. We're gonna to make today a great day. Um, if you guys did not see last year's Christmas video, I will link it up here. You'll see that she did have a pretty tough time with Christmas. Um, it's all about adapting, adapting to what she needs. For me and Stacy, we don't completely understand how the overwhelming feeling that she's feeling when all this stuff is happening. We just wanna make sure that we're not overwhelming her today. That's that's probably one of the, the things I worry about the most about Christmas is overwhelming her. I think we're ready. I think we are ready. Everybody's still sleeping, so I'm going to take care of the animals, get them fed, maybe do some dishes. We decided to not have the presents under the Christmas tree this year. Big part of that is because these pine needles are so pokey. Merry Christmas, Carlos. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Nemo. Merry Christmas, Dory. Sun's not really coming up because it's cloudy, but sun's coming up. White Christmas, there's snow on the ground this year. Are you a Christmas tree? <laughs> All right, Braley. First things first, we didn't uh, open the last one yesterday. The last one. We forgot Let's we pretend it's still Christmas Eve. Yep. Do it, last one. Make it count. 
I don't even remember what's in this one right now. Oh, look at that. Take it out. You want the paper? That's one you can do all by yourself. Do you love it? Yeah, you got balls in there, huh? We've had one before, but it's hard for her to do herself. The one that we had, so. This one's perfect. You can do it all by yourself. Let's go see your playroom. I don't know if you've noticed, Braley, but you haven't been able to get in your playroom. And there's a reason why. Okay, are you excited? Go, go in here. Go in. Go in your room. What is that? What do you think? <laughs> I know, it's a guitar, huh? You can play it. Just give her a second. Something to climb on. Take it all in. Do you like your new room? She loves opening presents. She loves to unwrap. <laughs> what are those? <laughs> yeah. That's definitely not the drum set, though. Go over there. Sit down. Go sit down. We should go, you should go grab her headphones. Head We're gonna go, wait, wait, mom's gonna go get your headphones. <laughs> on the ca or on the table. Coffee table. Ah, oh, yeah! Here. Ready? There you go. Right, go play! You can put your Christmas, she really wants to be a Christmas tree. I know. No, hey. she doesn't want to. Hey, go play. Go play. Go play. What? She probably wants to put them on herself. Yep. Hold my sticks, Mom. Oh, she wants her head covered and then them put on. She knew exactly what these are for. Go, go play. ahead. Go play. Take your go play. Go play. Should I show her? Hey, look. Can you sit down right here? Sit and play them. Hey. Show her the foot pedal. <laughs> ready? <Come on. laughs> uh oh. Hold on, these ready. Yeah, get them all. Do you think she knows about the foot pedal? She's trying it. She get your headphones in here for whenever yeah, you want to use them. This one's from our Wii Fam. Yep. From YouTube. Where do you start? She's trying to push yep. it open. Look. Go from there. Yep. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
What do you think? <laughs> she loves imagining. All right. Do you want to open one more while we're in here? We can play with that later. Yeah, we'll open that one in a little bit. What about this one, Braley? Can you do this one? <laughs> she knows the drill. She's trying to get the markers and put it There's a marker right here, huh? Yep. What do you think? We're gonna mount this onto the wall for you. Yeah. Break it in, breaking it in. <laughs> Can you say thank you? That was awesome, Dee. The cats are like, surprise! <laughs> They're set up ready for you to take it. Go! <laughs> yeah! That's way bigger than your rocking horse, huh? Whoa! <laughs> she's so happy about it. Never overjoyed with things, but you can tell she's happy. Like she's content. Yeah. Oh, what do you what do you see over there? She was eyeballing it. <laughs> the, <laughs> like, the present she's pile. She's here and she's like this. She looks over all subtle. <laughs> you see the present pile? Yes, she sure does. <laughs> <laughs> she's gonna get to it, I guess. Yeah, those are scented markers, so they smell. Just put she this. What is that? Do you know him from school? So she is really fascinated and obsessed with buckle boards and fasteners, I guess you'd say. And this is one of the tools that they used actually to help her with that program that they have for buckles and fasteners. Yeah. She's going to be doing this for quite a while. Yeah. The, which so is good. The first thing she does in the morning when she gets there, if allowed to just kind of choose on her own, is she'll go into a room and find the buckle boards and just start doing them repeatedly over and over again. So this might occupy her for a while. In no time, that's like her comfy spot too. Yeah. Like that's where she goes when she wants to be comfy. She leans up against her crash pad, just like that. This is something else that they have at the center. We got it smaller scale, but they had it at the center and got rid of it. And it was one of her favorite things to stem on, I would say. You close that thing over like nobody's business. Can you unroll it? What is that? Is that your very own jungle rug? Huh. Remember you do this? It's your very own jungle rug. Do you think she's happy about it? Yes. Look. Does this look familiar to you? You can even cover up with it. It is pretty soft. Are you just creating your school right here? Set it right here. Your feet can go down. You can do your buckles. Something I would suggest for your kids if you're teaching them buckles and zippers, um, something like this. Just because they're like toys pretty much, but they also are very functional. Well, and I like the size of this because 
we could take this with us. This is like travel size. Or like road trips or even an airplane ride. This would be great for that. It's your buckle buddy, huh? That's all for now. We're gonna let Braley just chill and open as she wants to. Mm -hmm. We're not going to force anything. Just wanna show you a few of them just because these are it's really Christmas. cool items. And it is Christmas. And it's, we've been waiting for some of these the time things. For giving, yeah. We've been waiting for a long time and didn't disappoint. She went right to those drums. She loved this stuff, the the whiteboard and then the, the Mickey. I'm gonna give Stacy her presents hey. too. Frog. I already gave her uh, heated socks. Frog. Perfect for the Good state dog. of Minnesota. Zebra. Do you like your heated socks? Alligator. I haven't tried them yet. It's actually not cold enough to use them, but it is something that will be so useful. Because I'm always telling David how bad my feet hurt. So this is actually something that I don't think they know. I have issues, and I don't know if it's like Raynaud's or because of my thyroid issues or any of that. I have issues with my hands and feet to where if they get cold too fast, like it gives me actual stinging pains. So living in Minnesota, that's not like ideal. I'm excited to try them out when it does get cold. And I got David a beard cape. Is that what it's called? Some beard buddy. Know. So I stopped putting beard hairs in the sink. Yep, the ones that suction cup to the mirror and then when you shave it goes in there instead of everywhere. <laughs> Looks like we have some presents for ourselves to open up. Maybe we should show them what we got each other. Stay sexy and don't get murdered. If you guys are murderinos, type down below hashtag SSDGM. What is a murderino? Yeah, the people that listen to Karen and Georgia are murderinos. Like their fan base, how we have our WeFam, there's Moss Squad and Brazy Bunch. They're the murderinos. Interesting. Yeah. <laughs> Braley. Do you want to come see Dad's ears? Live long and prosper. That's pretty cool. Can we go to the Star Trek convention? <laughs> Christmas is almost completed. Yeah, we didn't really record a whole lot today after this morning. We just had a good old family time. Played a nice game of life with Grandma Pam. The game life has changed so much since we played last. That's all I can say. <laughs> but it was a good time. It was really fun. It was entertaining for sure. Really had a really good day up until probably about an hour ago. I think she's just winding down. It, there was a lot today. A lot happened today. I think she's just tired. That's a big part of it. Yeah. Ready for bedtime? She actually ended up opening all of her presents too, which she, did so she I'm so proud of her. She got through it all. We didn't even have to play with everything today. Overall, it was probably our best Christmas so far. She answered another question today that wasn't color based. The big jug of bubble baths, she pulled into the tub with her and I said, what are these? And she goes, bubbles. And that was really, really neat to see. So I'm starting to wonder if something's just clicking with her right now. Historically, when she has developmental stages, when she starts developing some new stuff, it always comes a lot at the same time. And then she plateaus for a long time, and then she gains a lot of Jumped new skills. Again. Yeah. And that's just what happens. And right now we are in one of those phases where she is just learning tons of stuff. A lot She's of, repeating a lot of words. A lot of new stuff's happening right now. And we're just gonna go with the flow. Really, did you have a good Christmas? Yeah, you got lots of cool things. We hope that you had a great Christmas day. I'm excited about this, what's coming up soon. Vlogmas is over. This is it. This is our last <laughs> Christmas video. Let us know what Vlogmas video was your favorite. We'd like to know. My favorite, I think, was when we got the tree. I think that was my favorite one. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas. Making our Christmas memories. Good night. Peace. Can you pound it? Pound it.